All right, I'm gonna do a rather poor video of how to wire these remotes. Um, and as you know, the manufacturers are not that good with some of their um, the information and forget writing. These, these seem to be made in China and then they're dispersed by several different manufacturers. I've had, uh, I've had that, I've had, you know, so you look at the label, YDBJ, something else there, then the telecrane comes up and I mean, it, it just becomes a circus. And this wiring diagram was a little bit confusing because they looked to be separate and what they were. And so what you've come to realize is that there's power to run this unit and then there's power that gets spread out through here. And the two are separate. And so if you look black and brown, okay, Power and ground. Okay, that's 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 what that turns out to be. That's not a separate unit that goes somewhere else. That's this. These are the sol there's a solenoid inside that allows power to go from the hot side through there, and that you'll you'll hear it click when we do this. So taking a little 12 volt charger, I rewired with a um, these little bits here, but you'll see no shock, no problem black, brown. I was assuming that that was something else and I didn't want to short it out, but no. I would watch somebody else's video and that's what it is. Black power, brown is ground, okay? Just trust that. Black to power, red is ground. Now, if you go back and you read the diagram, okay, what I found out is that red is a different, though it looks like red and orange are the same, you don't need them to be double. Uh, red is for one way of turning it on, orange is another. So if you'll look over here, on my hot side, I only have black and red. That's, that's it. I have the black wire and the red wire. Why? Because the black wire goes to the solenoid, the red wire goes to the other lines, and then brown is the ground. What I did was I rigged it with two separate lights because I got tired of trying to Jerry rigged this thing and I watched somebody else's video and along it came. So if you take the, the ground wires from your little trailer lights and you just gently hook them up. So there's, see my two ground wires from the trailer lights? Yellow is up, green is down. So yellow goes to one light Green goes to the other. So now, when we take our little doodad ridiculous remote and listen, you can hear it clicking. Oops, I broke my ground here. Hold on a second. Okay, you can hear it clicking as I press. That's actually this not the remote. That's a different thing. So now we hit start and we do up, down, up. And you'll hear every time it clicks, up, down. That simple, literally. Black and brown, power and ground, and then wire your lights. It's a very simple operation. Or, you know, for my in my case, I'm doing a, uh, a solenoid on a uh, skid steer apparatus. What this originally came on was a, um, a skid steer attachment made by AGT. It originally came on a skid steer attachment that was a hot mess. By the way, they're just, they are not the best for customer service whatsoever. That was a horrible experience dealing with them. The board that we originally got with one of their pieces was penetrated by water. So you can see all the oxidation there. The panel was ruined and it's been the devil trying to get them to do it. So in short, 
in here, put your power on one, your ground on the other. There you go. So power, ground, okay? Now you can either use orange or you can use red. And so let's watch what happens. So we take, we take the red off as far as power is concerned and we put the orange on. It still clicks. Oh, I probably broke my ground on it. Uh, oh, yeah, we did. So, okay, that's my on. And then, oh, I left something up. So pass, oh, you see the orange came off while I was doing this, okay. It's like it just worked. Okay, there's orange. This is very, very ghetto rigged here. Okay, so start. So as you can tell, whether you use orange or red, you're still good. Hope that helps. And then the other ones are just whatever you uh, want them to be. So again, power is black. That'll go to one. Brown is your ground for your DC stuff there. You can either use red or orange for your supply lines and then use your colors as you see fit. So for example, whatever you want, yellow, green, and then take your item, the ground wire from there and wire it to the same ground. It's just, it's just ground. So I hope that helps.